Now, now is the winter, winter of our May glorious summer by this sun of York and all the clouds that lowered upon our house in the deep bosom of the ocean buried. Have you finished, young man? We are called The King's Troop and we are an intergenerational community theatre group specialising in the performance of Shakespeare. Our bruised arms hung up for monuments, our stern alarms changed to merry meetings, our dreadful marches to delightful measures. You're not back to the fun! But now, instead of mounting... You're back to Amy's dad! Can you be quiet, young lady, no. and, let, and let the Duke of Gloucester say his lines and remember them? Grim visaged war had smoothed his wrinkled front. Now, instead of mounting, oh, it's deep. Is that right? Is that right? Instead of mounting barbage. This company, I think, is quite unique because we're intergenerational. So we have uh, families come and perform together, and um, we have an age range at the moment from age about four or five up to. 65 plus. It's uh, open to everyone, no experience needed, there's no audition process and we very much organically um, create the piece together. My lord, Edward, my lord, thy king, our son is dead! People don't have to necessarily learn the lines, they can use their scripts. Some people do like to learn, some don't. And some people turn up for rehearsals and some people don't. Some people drop out half an hour before the performance and we just um, really work with whoever, whatever is presented in front of us. Dan, if you take it too far, we won't be able to see it! If they have done the steam, my number. If, thou protector of this damned strumpet, talks to me of ifs, thou art a traitor. Guards, off with his head! Those that smile at me, who shortly shall be dead! Oh, well done! Oh, you okay? Yeah! Hello. Oh, well done! The woods are perfect for rehearsing in because they provide a natural amphitheatre. The children, when they get bored rehearsing, oh, and the adults as well, can just run off up into the woods and play, so it doubles up as a natural playground and a rehearsal space. That! Also allows uh, the children to um, ignite their imagination, and they can come up with really amazing ideas. And I, th I think um, the woods, this wood in particular, it lends itself to that aspect of the rehearsal. In Shakespeare's time, I think a lot of the rehearsing took place in this this way that people came together and rehearsed. It was quite a quick process. It wasn't a lengthy process. And although it seems very chaotic, um, it's amazing that um, when we actually come to perform, the whole thing comes together. Um, we've recently taken part in the Royal Shakespeare Company's Open Stages project for the 2012 Cultural Olympiad. And um, this performance we're doing is Richard III, which will be performed at the Dell, the open air space in Stratford, and we're doing a dress rehearsal this evening in the beautiful Nutclough Woods. <laughs> In our cast we have some solicitors, artists, university lecturers, we have students, 
health workers, uh, children, dance therapists, uh, some retired people, some accountants. So uh, across the board, a real mixture in different different backgrounds. A horse! A horse! My kingdom for a horse! Any ideas? <laughs> <laughs>